in the last video we talked about a priori algorithm we understood how to calculate support confidence and lift let's look at the definitions of support confidence and lift support as we understood is denoted as sup x arrow y is the number of transactions where x union y that means both x and y appears together appear together divided by the total number of transactions so here support of chicken arrow oil chicken and oil is the number of transactions where chicken and oil appear together divided by total transactions confidence is the number of transactions where chicken and oil appear together divided by the number of transactions where only x appears the support of chicken and oil divided by chicken only upon total transaction 4 upon 7 and a lift of greater than 1 indicates that x and y appear more often together this also means that the occurrence of x has a positive effect on occurrence of y or x is positively correlated so lift is a value which understands or defines the correlation and what do they mean obviously you would want to have all these values to be higher or high high support means that it applies to a large amount of cases or transactions so it means that there should be a good number of transactions which have chicken and oil together it's no point doing an analysis when there is one or two cases out of thousands that means it's a it's a very highly unlikely or it's just a coincidence high confidence means that it is correct very often so confidence gives you the value of the confidence higher the value of confidence it makes you understand that it's very likely that chicken and oil be put together so look let's look at the confidence again here it's 0.57 so 57 percent of the times the chicken and oil are bought together and finally high lift indicates that it's not just a coincidence so lift indicates that it if it's more than one that means it's highly likely a person buying chicken may also end up buying oil so in the next video we're going to talk about the hands-on and how we go about implementing a priori algorithm in R thank you for watching